Yo, what's going on YouTube and welcome back to another Destiny video. And in this video, I am back with another location for another one of the hidden chests in the new King's Fall Raid. If you guys missed the first video, then I showed you the location of the first hidden chest in the raid, but this time we're back with another one. Shortly after you defeat Golgoroth, you will enter what I like to call the Total Wipeout Area. You basically walk across these ledges and there are loads of these platforms or these kind of like pillars that shoot out and if you get caught by them, they will smack you off. Pretty much like Total Wipeout. When you get to the end of it, however, there's a plate you need to stand on and this summons some platforms. However, again, like the last one, just before you go the route you're actually supposed to go, if you look at the wall, there is once again another crack or an opening, and if you go in there, there is indeed another chest. Now this one itself doesn't actually need too much explaining, instead it just needs me to show you how to get there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave you guys to watch this, but basically what you need to do is look towards the wall, and there's a few different platforms you need to jump on, and you need to jump between sort of ledges on the side of these pillars, and also some invisible platforms which you'll want to bring out your ghost to reveal. Either way, if you look at the route in the background, you'll then find the platforms that lead you up to this door, you walk inside and there's another one on the chest with a loot drop very similar to the first one. If you guys do find this video helpful or you did enjoy it, then a like would be massively appreciated and be sure to share this with anyone else that's also working through the raid. Keep it locked to the channel because I've got some boss guides coming your way later on today, but aside from that, thank you very much for watching, take it easy, catch you next time, peace out.